these algorithms, honey. I can't keep up with these algorithms. Oh, it'll be okay. You'll figure it out. There's just too much riding on the line here. And Mr. Anderson's gonna have my hide. Well, you know, maybe I can do something to take your mind off. Knock it off! I need my fluids. I need to study. What was that? I don't know. Do you think we have rats again? Oh god, I hope not. Oh, those things are so gross. Well, I'll go set the traps. Oh, uh, would you mind? No, not a problem. I'll be right back. Fucking around. I'm tired. Look, I mean it. Stop fucking around. Pretty good one, it sounds like. Widow, young woman. Sounds, sounds good, sounds. She sound good, hot, good? Yeah. Good, yeah. hot, good. They all do. Yeah. I'm liking the architecture. Solid, built in the 80s, yeah. not gonna fall down. Well, yeah, yeah, they got the brick. Listen, one way or another, we're here to score. Let me do the talking, whether it's I get the life insurance from this dead dude, or we make money killing a ghost. Don't care, okay? As long as we get it done. Just right. let me talk. Yeah, we got it. All right. Oh, are you the ghost guys? Hi, ma'am. Good afternoon. We're from the Malford Paranormal Society. These are my associates. This is Jeffy Jacobs. This is Evan Smigouli, and my name is uh, Rick, Rick Shackman. But you can call me uh, anything you want. We're, uh, I'm sorry, we're, we're here for uh, your, your dead husband, ghost, the ghost, the, yes. Oh, you're the ghost guys. Come in, come in, come in, yeah. come in. Yeah, that's what I said, but yes. It's a very lovely home you have here, man. Very lovely. Thank you. Almost as lovely as uh, as you. Oh, thanks. Uh, so my associates here uh, told me that they got a frantic call from you. Can you uh, tell me? Oh, don't mind them. They're uh, they're just getting some readings. Perfectly normal. Uh, okay. I want you to focus on me here. Oh. Okay. And uh, and I will help you through this process. Well, my husband just died, so there's that. There's been a lot of really weird activity happening here, if that's what you want to call it. Noises. It sounds like someone's moving around, shuffling, bumps. I, I understand. No, that's that's good. You're, you're starting to, to open up. So share more with me. How long were you and your husband together? What, what was the relationship like? Was he abusive? Did How often did he hit you? How hurt are you? Can A lot of our uh, our customers find it comforting to, to talk to someone, get some, some therapy, you know, a little physical therapy sometimes. I'm sorry, what does this have to do with the investigation? Often paranormal activity can be caused um, from some sexual frustration that's lingering in the air. So how often did you did you do it? How often did what? you slam? 
Um, what? So, well, I guess my real question is, uh, he, he could be sticking around because uh, he, he, he didn't do it enough and he, he still wants to get some. There, there's something left. I do not see how this is pertinent. Uh, so I'll take that as uh, he, didn't, he didn't do it very often, maybe a few times a year. And that's why he's sticking around, I understand. Excuse me? So, and you're probably very built up too, all that sexual thing. Beckman, has got a reading. Yeah, yeah, no, that's, that's great. It's fine. Town records say this house was built on an ectoplasmic ley line. Well, well, uh, Jacobs, I think ley line is a bit generous. I, I, from what I understand, there wasn't much laying going on here, right? Okay, my husband was killed. Maybe you guys want to check out the basement? Oh, I'd love to check out your basement. Okay. Yes. Down under, under a bit, yeah. Down. Let's do it. Let's, uh, down here. That's what she meant. She meant the basement. Is your uh, husband by any chance a Sasquatch? What? He, he just fell in a weird way. Why did they... Why did they use tape? Oh, well, the uh, limestone deposits have been dwindling over the last 60 years. Plus those child labor laws have been really... Shove it, Maguli! Oh, okay, fine. Um, walk, walk me through what happened. He heard... A, we heard a noise in the basement. He came down to check it out. Mm -hmm. Then there was another noise. He was gone, and when I came down here, I saw a thing, a ghost. I don't know what you want to oh, call it. Poor thing. You're in such a fragile state right now. Well, a ghost would indicate a paranormal presence. I think we got enough information. We'll uh, we'll get back to you. Well, well, not so fast. I think I think we're we're done. My associates are done here, but I'd like to spend a little more one-on-one -on -one time with you going over the, the details um what are you what are you doing say later on tonight <laughs> again guys this pizza represents the last of a petty cash this job of yours better pay off smigoolie Pay off or put out? I don't care. Well, if uh, Romeo over here could string a couple inoffensive words together, maybe we could all afford a plate. Yeah, whatever. She was into me. Anyway, what did we find out? While you two were pulling your puds down in the basement, I spent some time going around the house. Needless to say, I'll be sitting out of the attic for the rest of my life. Why is that? Needless to say, I feel like that you need to say that. You say that. Spiders. Spiders. Shove it, Smigoli. Man, this, this house is really throwing Jacobs for a loop. Anyway, about the readings. So the readings were a little concerning. Uh, let's just say if, if this pepperoni represented all the paranormal activity in that house. This is what she's gonna be doing at the end of all this. Anyways, it's not like we had sex all the time, but I thought it was enough. You know, he was busy with his algorithms. Oh, what were those credit rates that you called to talk to me about? Uh, I'm gonna have to call you back. Yes, yes, hello. This is the Paranormal uh, Melford Society. The Melford Paranormal Society. Uh, this is, uh, this is Rick speaking. Hey, hey, it's, it's Zoe Loren. Rick, no, shut up. Listen to me. There's something here right now. Get in my house. There's something here and it's after me. You guys have to get here now. 
No, 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 not tomorrow. Tonight, now. Oh, yes. Uh, uh, we'll be there as soon as we can, Miss Loren. Okay. Bye. I love you. That was uh, a little sex pot. Sounds like she's uh, in trouble, actually. Shocker. So, are we going there tonight? No, dude. I'm not going to a haunted house in the dark. It's fucking scary. And you heard Jacobs? There's spiders in the attic. Listen, we'll we'll go there. We'll suit up. We'll go there first thing in the morning. How about that? here. Smagula, is this tech of yours gonna work? Our lives are on the line. Listen, that smoking hot sex deprived widow in there needs our help and I'm gonna give it to her. Anyway, the tech is sound. I put the fishing touches on it and I upload it to your phones. You turn my phone into a proto-nucleic ectoplasmic accelerator? Nah, both your phones. Okay, let's do this thing. So the door opened on its own. That would make this a uh, category seven spirit and we're going right in there. All right, I love this plan, let's do it. Let's do it. Could be anywhere boys, keep your eyes peeled. Mm -hmm. Guys, there's our invitation. is down there, she's either possessed or she's DTF. You know what I mean? Hmm. Let's yeah. get it, boys. So, well, hold on, hold on. Let me go first. Okay. Let me so they hear check us it always out. first. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Next one is mine. Oh. Hey, sweetheart, what are you doing? <sighs> hey, guys. Yeah. You, you, you should come in here. Really go faster, maybe. There's the ghost, boys. Light her up! Show this bitch how we do things downtown! Yeah, get some! <laughs> Smoogoolie, your tech worked, but you disintegrated our client. Yeah, I did that. <sighs> Guys, I really think she was the one. So. What do we do now? Uh, I'm gonna run upstairs real quick, guys. Find the checkbook, I'll meet you outside. I should probably go. Yeah. 